Hello and welcome to Hakista TV and in this video I will be showing you the RFID cloning feature of Flipper Zero. Now to appreciate how easy it is that you can do it here on Flipper Zero, I would like to show you how I used to do it. And this is using a KaliNet Hunter phone, also known as a hacker phone. Now don't worry, I will be doing a video in the near future how you can create your very own hacker phone and this device which is Proxmark 3 this is the de facto device if you want to hack RFID the app that we will be using is Walrus and the way that you can connect a Proxmark 3 to a phone is using an OTG cable so let's connect it now micro USB USB A and another micro USB to Proxmark 3 okay it will have a white light here and it should be able to um, I mean the phone should be able to detect it click OK as you can see Proxmark 3 now to add or copy an RFID you just put it here click add new card let's name it as original or OG OG set data Proxmark 3 HID okay as you can see it had copied it as an FC 124CN3078 click save now let's set this aside here and put and have flipper zero on the menu let's have one to five kilohertz RFID put the RFID here at the back and click read and as you can see it has already read it as one two four three zero seven two eight now what we're gonna do is let's click emulate and put it here since we still have our cloning setup here add new card let's name it as copy and set data HID and as you can see it had copy FC124 CN30728 from flipper 0 and let's click save and yeah those two are identical meaning that whatever lock or whatever entry this RFID is allowed flipper zero can emulate it okay now that is how you can clone an RFID on flipper zero and if you enjoy this video be sure to watch my other flipper zero related video here on Hakista TV Till next time, my fellow Hakista.